Hi everybody, it's Patty, Rockstar Mom, and oh boy, I hope today's going to be as much fun for you as it was for me trying these clothes on. We're going to look at how many ways you can actually wear a black jumpsuit. And I'm going to tell you right off the bat, you can wear it as many ways as you have tops to put over it. I, wait until you see this. First of all, let me say that many of y'all know that I'm getting ready to cruise, and it's a 10-day cruise, so we'll have to sort of dress. Uh, it's, it's really changed. The evenings have changed on cruising now, on most ships, I think, and, and the evenings are no longer so formal, but they really are, for most people, most cruisers, they really are just uh, a step down from formal. It's it's more, I wouldn't say cocktailish, but maybe even a step down from that. Maybe very dressy casual or dressy casual. And so I started thinking about this because I had this black jumpsuit and I started thinking that this might be something that I could carry on this cruise and I could just uh, pack that one thing for the evening, for or for most evenings, and then I can just put different tops on it every night. We've chosen for this cruise, which we've done before, uh, gosh, we haven't cruised in over two years, well over two years, just before the pandemic started was the last cruise. But some of the times when we cruise, we do not eat in the big dining room at night with uh, all with everybody. We there's a smaller dining room uh, that they have on, on this particular ship. It's called I think the Aqua Class, and it's a I believe it's a mini suite. And then uh, you can dine in that big dining room, but but there is another dining room where you can dine. And but more than that, we plan on e having our evening meals mainly at the different restaurants on board. So, you know, unless you're sitting in that main dining room, probably, and, and typically when you do that, you are assigned a table and you there can be up to eight people at that table. Uh, and so you're going to be seeing the same people most nights. You know, they might say, oh, I think she had that same jumpsuit on. Was, is that the same jumpsuit? Well, after a few nights, if you're wearing it every night, surely they're going to know. But I know that I'm going to take this. I don't know which of these tops yet I'm going to take. I have a, a few other things that I'm not going to show you today that I'm going to take that are uh, very dressy casual for evenings. First of all, I'm going to show you the jumpsuit. And this is just a perfectly plain black jumpsuit. The fabric, I'm not sure what it is. It's sort of a crepey fabric. I will list it up here. But this jumpsuit is sleeveless, as you can see. V-neck, it, it crosses over and has a little snap right here to snap it. Um, it has a self-tie belt, and it has pockets. And it that's it. There, that's all there is to it. So you could wear it by itself for sure, or you can wear it with different tops, and that's what I plan on doing. One other thing on the jumpsuit. I bought this off of HSN a year or so ago, maybe, maybe longer. It's uh, Colleen Lopez, who is one of their show hosts, and I bought it, and I've never had a chance to wear it because of the pandemic. So this will be my first time to wear it. Now, I did go online on HSN to see if they were still available, and they are not. But uh, when I was in, I believe, Marshalls a week or so ago, they had a black, crepey looking jumpsuit that was almost identical to this and a whole lot cheaper. I would have bought that in a heartbeat had I not had this one. But I don't think, you know, unless you can get there and they, to your marshals and they still have it, you probably can't get it. What I will do is I'm going to, I've already looked a couple of times and I'm going to look again and I'm going to pick out two or three 
black jumpsuits that are similar to this that I would wear uh, using the same tops that I'm going to be showing you today. So if you're interested in this look, if you're interested in having something like this that can be so versatile for your wardrobe, not just for cruising, but anytime you have a really dressy event that you need to go to and you want to be comfortable, <clears throat> I think you just can't go wrong with a black jumpsuit. Now again, before I show you any of the tops, I want to tell you what I'm wearing with it. And uh, this is Chico jewelry that I bought recently and I believe they still have it. It's the necklace and the bracelet. These earrings I've had for a long time, they do have the earrings at Chico to match this. And I'm gonna, I hesitated about buying them because I didn't know if I would really wear them. But when I put this on together today, I regretted not having the earrings that match. So I'm gonna run back over to my Chico's when I get out later today, and I'm gonna pick those earrings up. The next thing I wanna show you are my shoes. And th this is a f truly funny story, and, and I thought about doing this in the past, but I, it's never been convenient for me to do it. But, uh, and this goes back to before the pandemic. I was uh, getting ready to go on that last cruise that we went on, and I, w I wanted just some dressy, really comfortable shoes that I could wear at night. You know, sometimes when you're on those ships, I don't care how big and uh, they are, you, you get a little motion. And when you're walking through those hallways or out in the open, if there's any motion at all, you're going to be like this a little bit. So, and sometimes it, as we're aging especially, it is a little bit more difficult to walk, to keep your balance. So I just happened to be in TJ Maxx one day, and I saw these shoes. And let me show them to you. I hope you can see them. I'll try to get away from the fireplace back there, the black box. But this is what they look like. I hope you're getting a good view of them. I, I make it take a, just take a picture of them so that you can really see them. These shoes are by M I M P O and it's called Stretch. And they, they're not leather, it's a faux leather, just a really small wedge, probably an inch or an inch and a half. And they're flexible and they're sort of padded a little bit. This is black elastic. They're perfectly plain. And this was the size seven. And that was the only size they have in them. And normally I wear a six and a half. But this seven fit my left foot perfectly. But my left foot is almost a whole size larger than my right foot. It has been all my life. And I normally just fit my left foot in a shoe and then I figure out how to make the right shoe work. Well, as I said, this was the only pair of these they had. And I remembered that while I was standing there that TJ Maxx has a website that you can order off of. Marshalls Home Goods don't, but TJ Maxx does. And so I thought, I'm going to buy these. Then I'm going to, oh, and by the way, I want to say they were $12.99. And oh, they have a rubber sole with some ridges for grip. But anyway, I bought them knowing I could bring them back if I needed to. I came back home and got on TJ Maxx website to see if they had them. They had them. They had them. And they had them in a six and a half. So I bought a second pair. And this is the six and a half. You can see it. It still has a... You know what? I may have bought the six and a half and ordered the seven. I think that's what I did. Because the six and a half, my toes came all, all the way to the end on my shorter foot. That's what I did. I bought the shorter one and ordered the half size up. Again, they were, I'm pretty sure, $12.99. Whatever I paid for these, I paid for these. And they're, it's perfect. 
you would never know by looking at my feet and look in these sandals, these shoes, that they're two different sizes of shoes. And I spent what, $25, $26 for this pair of shoes that I will wear until they're worn out because I'll probably only wear them when we cruise at night. And you know, when I need to be sort of dressy a little bit. I wear pants or a long dress at night when we cruise uh, to dinner and just out and about the ship. So, you know, they're not going to really show, but they're going to be, they'll coordinate and they'll be, and they're very, very comfortable. I did wear them on that cruise that I bought them for every single night and they were just perfect. So these shoes is what I'm going to wear on the cruise for sure, but with this uh, jumpsuit. The only, the other thing, this jumpsuit has a self-tie belt that, you know, is just long and you can, and it, the jumpsuit has elastic in the waist and you can blouse it. So I can, I don't have to wear this belt at all, but if you want to belt it, you can certainly belt it. When I was trying things on, I thought, you know what, I need like a gold belt, a narrow gold belt, maybe a chain. And I've been looking for the last couple of weeks for a gold chain belt in the stores, and I found plenty of them that I could buy that would work. But when I tell you they weigh a ton, they weigh a ton. And so I went on yesterday, Shein, Shein, S-H-E-I-N, uh, dot com, and I ordered uh, a narrow, it's a one inch gold belt. I know it's not leather, but it just has a small buckle and uh, it's it has nothing on it. It's, it's just very plain. And I, I had a memo or an email this morning that it shipped, so it's very likely I'm going to get that before we cruise and I can take it with me. So, and I ca usually carry a little small envelope type black purse that holds my phone mainly and my room key. So that's, that's pretty much it, uh, especially when we're cruising. But as I said, this is not so much about what I'm going to take on that cruise as to what all I can wear with this black jumpsuit. The first thing, and this has no labels on it, uh, I don't think I stood up and modeled it, but it's just a black little lightweight cotton kimono. I don't remember where I got this. I have had it forever. And it has some fringe on it. And you know, this and some of these other things you're gonna see will work fine for bathing suit cover-ups, especially on this cruise. So I I'm not gonna show you this, but that that this is this is probably the oldest thing that I have that I will probably take with me. Now, the next thing is probably the newest thing I've purchased. And I got this over the Christmas holidays when I was in TJ Maxx shopping. And not looking for it, I was just looking for something else and it appeared. And I bought it and the tags are still on it. It's a very sheer sort of a grayish, silverish burnout kimono. And it has some fringe on the bottom. And what I'm gonna do with these things, I'm, I'm gonna put the label maybe up somewhere here. And if you want to research it yourself and see if you can find something similar to it. But these things, especially that are really old or that I got at TJ Maxx or Marshalls, you're more than likely not going to be able to find it. But this is by David and Young. And I, when I bought it, I mean, I'm always on the lookout for things that I know I can wear for cruises because we cruise so much. And of course you can wear these things so many other places too. I mean, all of these, I could wear over my jeans, you know, with a little camisole, but $14.99. And I just, I mean, I think this is wonderful. The next thing, and when I tell you this is old, this has to be 15 years old. 
but I and I think I've shown this to you before, but I just can't part with it. I love this. I love it. I bought it at Soma, and it actually is a it's a kimono, but it is from it's the top to a pair of lounging pajamas. And when I was in there and I saw it, they had somehow lost the pajamas that went with it. And it was on the clearance rack. And I'm telling you, I love this. Um, but again, it's Soma, the lingerie. I think they're owned by Chico. The next top is, um, I've had this for probably five or six years. This is, the brand is, I'm gonna spell it, J-O-D-I-F-L. And it's a long sort of kimono, but it has elastic in the sleeves. And it's really sheer, it has a lot of colors in it, but it has black in it. And I'm going back to cruising with these things because, you know, this is this I would be very comfortable with any of these at night over this jumpsuit with those shoes. And this has black in it and it's cool and it covers my arms, which I want to do. I've had this one probably 10 years. I ordered it off of eBay <laughs> and it's like a poncho, but it's sheer. And it's perfect over this jumpsuit. I've had this probably 10 years. No label. I'm a big fan of black. I think y'all know that. I've had this saying for as long as I can remember that I'm gonna wear black until they invent a darker color. Well, this I fell in love with. Many of you I know watch Selena from the Vintage Bombshell here on YouTube. Selena uh, collects vintage clothes and, well, and jewelry, and, and she has a sale usually once a month, although she hasn't had one in a couple of months. And you can go to her website when, she's, when her sale is going on, and it's pretty much everything is one of a kind uh, because most of the jewelry is vintage, and any clothing or piano shawls or things like that are usually she only has one. Occasionally, she'll find something that she can get multiples of. And I sort of suspect this is one of those things. I don't think this is old, I don't think it's vintage, but she wore it in a video and then I saw when she had her sale that month, it was in her sale. And I, when I tell you as soon as I saw it, I bought it, I didn't wait a second. It's by Kite and Butterfly. And it's like a taffeta, or silk crepey fabric and it's embroidered. I don't know if you can see it with black roses. But look at, and it's short, it's not real long, but look at the fringe and you'll see it again when I model it. There's no size on it, so I'm sure uh, this is the one that Selena wore with things from Selena, if you're interested in this, I mean, this has probably been seven or eight months ago that I ordered this because, again, I knew I knew it would work great for cruising. And um, if you want to try to find this, uh, I'll leave Selena's uh, a link to her website, not her channel, but her website. And go to her website, and you can contact her there and just tell her that, I showed this and you were interested in it and is there any way she has more or can get more? It was not extremely expensive. Now this, I've had this probably eight or nine years and this came from Target. It's another long, very long kimono and it's the black see-through sheer with the burnt black velvet burnout. And it has fringe on the bottom. And I was just in Target one day and I was walking through and happened to see this on clearance 
on clearance. And I mean, I jumped at it because I knew it would be perfect, not just for cruising, but for anything that might be a little more formal or dressy. If it was black, uh, this would go. And I've worn this a few times actually already. And uh, I, it was before I had this jumpsuit, obviously. And I wore it with just a pair of black dressy pants. Uh, I think they were flowy, sort of baggy pants that were soft and flowy and a little black camisole. But I love this. I think I may have only paid about $10 for this on the clearance rack. So it's a lot of times, it's for me, it's just a matter of of seeing something and knowing that it would work uh, for my black jumpsuit or over just, like I say, a, a camisole and a pair of pants or a pair of jeans. I'm telling you, jeans would be great with any of these. Now, this, I'm pretty sure, came from Marshalls, and I've had this a few months. Again, this was on the clearance rack. It's by Pink Rose, and it's got a little sleeve. I really like the kimonos that actually have a sleeve. And it's just has a little black center in the flowers, and that's why I would wear it with this uh, jumpsuit. It's so cute, and as, as I said, it was clearance. It's got little slits on the sides. Some of these are great for summertime. Now that we're able to go out a little bit, if we're eating outdoors at restaurants, you know, it might be a little nippy at night, and uh, something like this is just perfect to put on over whatever you're wearing. The younger girls for sure would wear any of these over shorts even. This I know some of you have seen. Um, it's a dinner jacket and I got this at Dillard's. The brand is, or the label, is IC by Conic, C-O-N-N-I-E-K. And I think this is a brand that Dillard's carries. I don't know if it's one of their brands or if it's just a brand that they always carry, but I've been in, I went in Dillard's the other day looking for that infamous white button-down shirt, and I looked at a top that was this brand, so I know they still carry this brand. Whether they have this top or not, I don't know, but it's just really soft. The fabric, it's like sort of lame-ish. The sleeves are cuffed. Or they're like three-quarter length sleeves. Uh, I like the asymmetrical cut of it with the one big button. And our son, uh, back about five years ago, one of our sons, received a huge honor. And we were invited to go to the uh, event, and it was in Washington, D.C. at the Smithsonian, at one of the Smithsonian's. And... I bought this and I wore a black camisole under it with a pair of black dress pants. I love this. This will never leave me. The last thing, and this still has the tags on it, although I've never worn it, I've probably had it since before COVID, is just a little short kimono. And it, I got this at TJ Maxx. It's by Montu, Los Angeles, M-O-N-T-E-A-U. And it's just a little shorter, black, sheer with black roses, a little short sleeve. It's not as long as those other kimonos. And this was $19.99. So, I mean, other than, really and truly, other than that dress jacket, none of these were expensive. Not expensive at all, but you wouldn't know it. You wouldn't know it. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to show you each of the tops and then at the end uh, of the video I'll do a little fashion show where you can see me actually modeling them so that you can see how they look on with this black jumpsuit. Now that we're coming out of this pandemic, I'm going to get a 
ton of wear, I think, out of this jumpsuit. Now, I will tell you, too, something I did. When she came out with this one, she also came out with a, let me get it. As I said, I bought this at the very same time uh, that I bought this black one. So really with this, maybe you can have a little bit better idea what it looks like by itself. And I haven't worn it. It still has, as you can see, it's a V-neck uh, crossover. A little snap right here. It has elastic in the waist. Now this one has a different belt. The other one was a self-tie belt and this one is uh, just braided. And this is, uh, looks denim, but I believe it's called Tercel. That's what it is, but it's exactly the same jumpsuit. And I would never wear this jumpsuit. I'd have to be dying hot to wear it without something over it. I probably could wear one of those half tees or something under it. I wouldn't do that. I would pick a little kimono to wear over it that was light and breezy and summery to wear over it. But I will be wearing this this summer now that we're able to get out. And this may even go on the cruise with me too because I think there would be some things that we would do at night especially that this with a little a little kimono over it would be really, really cute. It's this Tercel fabric is so soft, so soft. Well, let me know what you thought about this. Uh, is a black jumpsuit something that you have already in your closet or is it something that you would be interested in? I just think black jumpsuits would fit any body type, especially the ones like this that have the elastic in the waist and the fabric is soft and and you could just do so much with them. You can just, you can put jewelry with them. You can put, you know, tops over, ponchos over them, kimonos over them. You could even, like with the little denim one, I could put, uh, my infamous button down over it. And I think that would be just as cute as it could be and leave it unbuttoned. Or maybe even bring it up at the waist and tie it around in front. I, I think that would be even cute with that little denim one. So what do you think about jumpsuits? Do you own any? If you do, have you, have you worn them? And how do you wear yours? Events do you wear them to? I would be interested in knowing that. All right, listen. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you more than you'll ever know. I love you, and I can't wait to see you in our next video. So don't forget to go out and be kind. Just be kind. I love you, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.